Today we are unboxing Boxy Charm. Um, this one's box is it's big, really big. Like it's thicker than normal. Like usually it's like two thirds of the size maybe. Um, and it's just like it's big. <laughs> like I I feel like this is um a premium box or something. I know it's I know. not. Um, the it's premium box is a little bit bigger than that. Yeah. But it's getting pretty close to the size. Yeah, it's like. Is big but so, we know not like bigger is not always better yeah so who knows it is $25 a month um, shipped directly to your door um, they do have premium which is $35 a month and then they have um, boxy Lux, and that is four times a year yeah, every three so months. Um, it comes in place I think of your boxy I don't know if they've changed that since I had it um but it is more of a lifestyle box which is why I didn't really enjoy yeah. it all right so before we get started though if you are not a current subscriber make sure to hit that subscribe button make sure to hit the notification bell so you're notified every time we upload a new video all right let's go ahead and jump in I like to feel around in case you don't know we like try not to spoil our bags like ipsy ipsy is really easy to spoil I it think. is because you get emails you can go on the app and check yeah yeah and you get like on ipsy plus you get to choose three of your items and so at the top is the other two items that they've already picked for you so i was like don't look don't look and yeah so we yeah. always try to make sure that everything is a surprise yeah all right, so I'm just gonna go with the top thing. I think it's a palette. Ooh. Violet Voss. All of you forever. Aww. That's so cute. All right, it's so it green. is an eyeshadow palette. Yeah, that kind of scares me, it being green. Let's try to... Especially when the name oh, get this open. says Olive. Yeah. I mean, it's definitely gonna be green. Okay. Wow. That's actually really pretty compared to what never... I was thinking so there it is I mean it's got some greens in it for sure a couple some of greens really to play pretty with. greens oh, this one neutrals that's actually such a pretty like it is. green palette some may say like oh that's not like for it to be like all of you forever and like a very green-esque packaging and stuff like that some may complain that it's not green enough for me, green isn't, even if I play with color, green isn't a color that I am typically going to go gonna, for. Gonna, yeah, play with. Like, me I'm going to play with pink, I'm going to play with blues, purples. Green just isn't, yeah, isn't for me, I feel like. But, but those greens look really pretty. Like, one looks like an olive, and one looks almost like a mossy. All right, well, I'm gonna go ahead and swatch some of these. So I'm gonna swatch both of these like greens in the corner. So all of me right here. And then all of glow right here. Okay. And then some of the neutrals. Yeah, I wanna go with the matte. So we're gonna go with this endless desire right here. That's a really pretty color. So here's that first green, um, forget the name. All of me. Yeah, all of me. And then here is all of glow. That's pretty. Hmm. That's a really this pretty has kind of like a, a more brown mm -hmm. undertone, undertone with some like green sparkly bits, um, which is interesting. And this is more of like a green undertone yeah. with green sparkles. And here is the matte. This is Endless Desire. That's actually pretty good as well. Oh my. Wow. This palette is actually like pretty good. I'm not mad about it for sure. Should we so, play with it maybe on our Subbox trial? Yeah. There's a big bubble wrap in here. I know. I was trying to feel around at some of the products and I could only feel like two because yeah. everything's probably wrapped underneath it. Okay. So. so there's a pretty good size box. Pharmacy. This is... Pharmacy is like my all-time favorite cleanser. Um, but this is a moisturizer, Daily Greens Oil-Free Gel Moisturizer with um, Moringa and Papaya. 
I'm I actually know. kind of excited about that because I am running low on my current moisturizer. Mm -hmm. Um, so who knows? Maybe I'll try that one out next. Unless I have, I feel like moisturizers aren't something I get a ton of. Yeah. So unless I have something else that I should probably use up before that one, then I might be giving that one a try here soon. Okay, on the top of it, right there, it says Farmer Cultivated, Scientist Activated. Ooh, I see a green theme going on with that. But yeah, that I kind of do too, now that you mention it. Okay, it comes with a little, do you want to kind of feel of it? No. No? But I do want to smell it. It's a fresh smell. It may be some of the papaya. Maybe. maybe. What else did you say was in it? With moringa and papaya. Yeah, I, don't I don't know what idea. moringa I don't even know is. What, I don't even know what papaya smells like. But maybe that could be the papaya that's It, it maybe. Like? It maybe. Yeah, oh. maybe so. I I'm, love the jar. I'm excited about it. That's, though. yeah. Usually I'm not too excited. excited about skincare products, but... I mean, hey, sometimes, you know, once in a blue moon sort of thing. Then it's okay. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Um, this, this, is what I, this is what I chose. Oh, okay. So we're going to go for this. I keep forgetting that BoxyCharm, you actually get to choose. Yeah, one of and you choose it, like, so far in advance. Like, I chose this, like, December 13th or December really? 12th or whatever. Um, like, I've already chosen next month's. Seriously? Yeah. Yeah. All right. So, this is the, I should have learned how to say it. <laughs> um, Avant. 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 How do you say I it? I don't. Like, did I even say it Avant? correctly? I want to say so Avant. So, is it Avant, Avant, or how else do you say it? Avant. 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 Okay. It almost looks like a, I don't know if you guys can see it or not. It almost looks like a crossword puzzle on the front, but it's like, oh, <laughs> hyaluronic. Yeah. Marigold. Marigold. Don't know that. Yeah, we're just going to pretend we know all these <laughs> words, but um, it is a, it says biphase hyaluronic acid rejuvenating micellar water. I so, would not like, I would not mind having that. Um, I'm, I'm pretty sure it's really, really expensive. expensive. Like $80. That's what I was fixing to say. Um, and the only reason I chose this, cause usually, you know, I'm not about the skincare and I think all of the options, like there were two other options maybe, and they were skincare as well. This seemed like the safest option being a micellar water, um, versus like a eye cream or yeah. something. Yeah. So, cause she uses a lot of the micellar water. I, I do. So, so, um, Shake before use, of course, um, to combine the two phases. Saturate a cotton pad with the solution, and then wipe the pad across your face, eyes, and lips for cleansing and makeup removal. Okay, so I feel two little boxes. I'm gonna just pick one. This is Seraphine Botanicals. I tried a blush from them before. I think I've had, this is a glow lip mask. So, okay. something, you know, the wind is blowing. Like, I think they were saying that, um, I think I have one of these. But this is Did apple you? and balme. Um, do you want to kind of look at it, smell, you know, all that stuff? I do want to smell Cause it. Because. a little protector thing. I'm pretty sure I've gotten a lip balm mask or something like that. Does it smell like apples? Yes, it does. Oh, I want to eat that, honestly. You oh. probably shouldn't, but... I mean, it's it's on it's your lips. lips. Yeah. So, you, you, I mean... Ooh. You're bound to just lick it off accidentally. <laughs> that smells really, really good. It does. That smells delicious. It smells like an apple orchard. Mm-hmm. Mm. I want to go back to the orchards, but, you know, that's not till, like, September. <laughs> so. And even still, like, if... You know, things haven't changed know. much. Like, we could the go. Yeah, the orchard so. was closed. They would pick the stuff. And then, like, you could come and you could buy, like, bushels of it or whatever. Yeah. But it's just not the yeah, same. Yeah, it takes the I fun like, out of it. I like going and, like, picking my peaches and picking my apples. Yeah. All right, so, so. last product. This is Trust Fun Beauty Lipgasm. Um, it's a lip gloss in the shade Unprofessional. 
taking some uh, inspiration from NARS with the yeah. I just saw something. I think it was on. Which one? I can't get it open. I think it was on Facebook. I just saw something today, and it was something gas on. Oh my! <laughs> I will not be using this, guys. I'm sorry. So, she's not going to swatch it either. Um, it's probably really good. You know, it's lipgasm. Um, but this is just not my shade. So yeah, that is not. Um, I'm going to, I'm I'm glad I didn't keep working at the box and like rip it. Because um, I'm going to pass it along to one of you guys. Um, just because it's a shade that would not work yeah. for me. Um a shade that I personally just won't use doesn't mean that somebody else won't get good use out of it. Um, but yeah, guys. And that's why we you do. See, you see what I wear <laughs> all the time. This just isn't it. So, so yeah, we, um, on things like that that we know we're not going to use, we want to pass it along to somebody who will use it. Yeah. So we don't swatch. We don't anything yeah. so that everything stays nice and clean. Yeah. So... <laughs> I, just, I hope you guys, like, I know a lot of you would prefer us not to swatch it and just pass it along versus us go ahead and swatch it for you guys so you can see the color and then it just sit in our, like, makeup In the collection. back of our makeup yeah. drawer. Um, <laughs> so, hopefully one of you guys really gets some, like, enjoyment out of it. So, the Violet Voss Olive... Olive You Forever eyeshadow palette is actually a new launch and it That's is a retail cheap. value of $34. That's actually, I love that it's a new launch. I like do they, too. they said that it was a new launch. Um, I've known in the past that they've had something that was mm -hmm. like a newer Brand launch new. um, and they didn't mention that. And I was like, that would have made it so much more exciting to know that you were one of the first people to kind mm -hmm. of test it out. Because sometimes I do wonder if boxes are able to get some of these products because they're just an older, yeah. unwanted product. Right, you know, they like, don't sell anymore yeah. or whatever, yeah. I've wondered I've, that too. I've wondered that, and it's kind of like... Yeah, but when it it's makes it brand less exciting, new, yeah. like right, hot off the presses, whatever, that does make it really exciting. All right, so the Pharmacy Daily Greens Oil-Free Gel Moisturizer is a retail value of $38. The... <laughs> Avante... I, I wonder, not oh, an it's I. not an A or an I. Avant. Avant. It's more expensive than I Avant. thought. Not by a lot, but it's more expensive than I thought. It is, um, this is the Biphase Hyaluronic Acid Rejuvenating Micellar Water. Retail value of $90. Oh my gosh. Hopefully this, like, gets into every single little pore. Hopefully it doesn't really... break me out. True. <laughs> I'm hoping. If it does... <laughs> You can let me try it and see if it breaks me out. <laughs> All right. So next is the Seraphine Botanicals Apple and Balm Glow Lip Mask. I don't know how to say that word. Um, retail value of $25. Wow. And then the Trust Fund Beauty Lipgasm Lip Gloss in the shade Unprofessional is a retail value of $18. So really good value. Unprofessional. Yeah. <laughs> that is... They're really going with the, the I, whole thing. I don't, Unprofessional lip gasm. I mean, I'm into it. Don't get me wrong, but <laughs> they're going there with it. <laughs> um, I think that this this box was good. And I think the value is definitely there. Mm -hmm. The new product is definitely oh, yeah. like makes it more exciting that there is a new product. Um I wouldn't but, mind playing with this myself. Maybe you can try it in the Starbucks try on as well. I will probably. Well, I think you probably I, have a lot of eyeshadows anyway, but probably. you you can play around with it. But um, it's a lot of skincare. In this it one. is. It, it's it's um, pretty heavy in skincare. I mean, I got the micellar water, the moisturizer, and then the lip mask. So there's three things there that are skincare. But um, it's not bad skincare. Like no. this is all. It's all stuff that, that I, definitely would want I to can try. use, um, and it typically those types of things won't break me out. Some moisturizers can if they're too heavy, um, but my solar waters, I've never had one break me out. Um, and then a lip mask, it's, you know, that's, my lips yeah. don't break out. Do lips break out? 
right around the end. No, I, yeah, I know but that, like but yeah. I don't, I don't think I've ever Because I used out. to not think like, oh, your under eyes can't break out. And I've had a small little spot in it. That spot is so sensitive. It hurts so bad. But I used to think that you couldn't get a breakout yeah, under your I've eyes. I've not seen a breakout. Let me know if you can. Even like a cold sore or something like yeah. that. You know, but. But if you know. I've if, seen a lot of mouths. That's true. That's true. Um, so let me know what you guys thought of this box um, this month. Let me know what you got in yours. Also, mine was um, C21010292 BA. I've never seen a number like that, but that's what it says down there. So um, <laughs> yeah, let me know what you got. Let me know what you thought. But that's going to be it for this video. All right. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a great big thumbs up. We will actually have a couple of videos linked right over here that you just got to go watch. And the subscribe button is right down here. So until our next video, bye. bye.